Hello everyone, welcome to Encryption, the tech tips and tutorial channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to push your localhost projects to GitHub repository, update from localhost to GitHub, and also I'll show you how to pull changes from GitHub repository to the localhost. Here I have used Jamp software to develop and test websites locally. So just to show you, I'm gonna create a demo project. So I changed the current directory to slash opt slash lamp slash stdocs and list the contents at the same time. Now I create a directory here uh, using sudo space mkdir and the name of the directory as test project. Then I change the directory to test project. Now I'm gonna create a file using sudo space nano and give the file name as index.html. On my text editor, I have a piece of HTML code. I copy it and paste it to the index.html file, which is now open on the terminal. Press Ctrl plus O to write out and press Ctrl X to exit from the file. Now to test it on browser, I go to Firefox and type localhost and hit enter. We can see the jump welcome page, which means jump is running just fine. And the web server is also running. For the project that we just created, I type the URL as localhost slash test project. There you go. We can see the web page running on the localhost server. Next, I am going to create a GitHub repository. So in the new tab, I type github.com. If you don't already have the GitHub account, you need to sign up for that and verify the email. In my case, I have already signed up, so I'm gonna sign in. I type my username, type the password, and click on sign in button. Here, click on create repository. I give the repository name as test git repo. Go all the way down and click on create repository button. Okay, an empty repository is created. Here you can read the instructions on how to create a new repository on the command line and push or pull from there. Next, we need to copy this URL that's also known as the remote repository URL. Then go to the terminal. Make sure that you are on the directory of the project which you are going to create a local repository and push or pull changes to or from the remote GitHub repository. First, you need to install the Git packages before you can create repositories. So for that, use sudo space apt-get space install space git wait until the required packages are installed now type sudo git init to initialize your folder as a git repository then type sudo git add space dot to add all the files to the staging area as known as index to prepare them for the next git commit. Now you need to commit the files that you previously staged by running sudo git commit space minus m. Type the message in the double quote and hit enter. As you can see, one file changed. Now type the command as sudo git remote add origin followed by your remote repository's URL where your local repository will be pushed. I have already copied the URL from GitHub when I created the repository. So I just paste it using Ctrl plus Shift plus B key sequence. Now to verify the remote URL, run sudo space git space remote space minus B. We can see the URLs. Finally, push your local project up to the remote repository you specified using sudo 
git push origin master type the github account username and type the password of github account okay we are done now to verify let's go to github here i just reload the page and we can see the file that was just pushed from the local host the project has only one file that is index.html but you can add other files in the project in the local host and push it to the github we can also modify any file on the local host and then push the modifications so let's have a demo of modifying the file in the local host or the local repository and pushing it to the github repository go to the terminal i open the file index.html with a nano text editor i copy this line paste it onto the next line edit the text and replace it with please like subscribe and share to spread us press control plus o to write out and press control plus x to exit from the file to check the repository status run sudo space git space status as you can see index.html file is modified to push the updates to github repository add the file as sudo git add index.html if you wanted to update all you could just give a dot after the add but we are just going to update the index.html file only so i just added the file index.html then commit the changes using sudo git commit iphone m let's give the message as a uh, new line added then finally push the file to the remote repository that is github repository give the github username and type the github users account password it's done going to github page here for now we can just see two lines the changes is not updated yet i reload the page now we can see the line is added on the file from the local host if you reload the page on the browser there also you can see the new line added on the page next i am going to show you how to pull changes or the modifications from a remote repository that is github to a local host project here i modify this file in the repository and get that modification to local host as well so click on this pen icon to edit the file i copy the last line paste it on the next line remove the text and write as line added from git repo scroll down a bit and press the commit changes button it will save the changes now i go to the terminal clearing the screen i read the index.html file here we don't see the line that was just added from the github on the file to get changes in the local host that was made on the remote repository uh, we need to pull it so uh, first you should make sure from which branch you are pulling in our case there is only one branch that is master but in the production environment or real time development environment there may be more than one branches and pulling the file of other branches doesn't make any sense in our case there is only one the master branch so pull from that using sudo git pull origin master as you can see one file is changed this means index.html file has the changes and that is merged to localhost project as well to verify let's read the index file using cat here we can see the line is replicated on the localhost project as well also if we check in the browser 
by just reloading the page we can see it now for the similar type of demo i'm going to create a file in the localhost project directory and push it to the remote github repository so nano error.html in this file inside the s2 tag and inside the center tag i write error page not found and i close the html tags write the changes and exit out from the file checking the current local repository status we can see error.html file is added on the project but if I check if that's updated in the remote repository, we don't see that. It's because we haven't pushed that file from the local host to this remote repository. So go back to the terminal, type sudo git add error.html to add in the local repository. Then commit the changes using sudo git commit hyphen m and the message let's give it as error page added finally to push the file run sudo git push origin master give the github username and then type the password it's done now to verify go to github page where the remote repository is then reload the page as you can see, the error.html file is there. Okay, friends, this is how we can work with localhost repository and remote repository using a Linux system. In this video, we learned how to create a repository in GitHub, push modifications in a file from local to remote GitHub repository, how to pull modifications from remote to local, and how to push new files from localhost to github repository i hope the video was useful to you please subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon thanks for watching this video see you in the next until then have a nice time goodbye